Hello, this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Gungnir! It's time for the final battle against Rodriguez. I think this is the last time we fight him. But, okay, so let's get started here. Definitely want Julio out as my ace, as usual. Let's see, let's put Alyssa here so that way she can get out there more quickly with the arrow heart. I also upgraded that to level 9 since last time. You definitely want a thrower to deal with Pamela and Paulo to uh, try and do a little crowd control there. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Aren't we all outlaws here? Well, I suppose that would assume that there is law around here. But I am the law! Well, so we lost Ragnus. And, uh, Valerie. And pretty much all the Lyanikins. But other than that, we're doing great! Okay, so, first things first. Uh, let's see. Let's have Paulo go over here. Get Cold Ruin. Try to hit all three of the Tamers there. If I can get Frozen on even one of them, that would be really nice. Now, I have antidotes equipped on my entire party because, well, they got heart. You can inflict that on us. So, or inflict poison on us. So, you want to watch out for that. Let's see. Now, with uh, Pamela here, normally what she does is she just stays up here on this pillar and nukes us from the top of the screen there. Whatever shall we do? Well, I actually stumbled onto a solution to deal with her permanently. Right in the middle of this pillar, it's kind of hard to see, but... There's a pitfall there, so you could just knock her back right into that. Boom, she dies instantly. So I want to take her out like that. So let's just go with a good light drop. Besides, no one else that I care about is ever going to be able to get up there to hit her to get weapon mastery anyway. So let's just knock her out, be done with it, and move on. But all right, good job. Ha ha. Even though she's a witch, for some reason she doesn't fly anyway. So, but that works. Man, I couldn't even get one of them frozen? That's sad. Oh well. Now that assassin that just moved back there, uh, she's always going to stay back there, so I don't recommend going after her. It's going to take too, it would take too long to go back there and attack her anyway and then get back up front which is kind of hard to do uh what was that oh she just like grabbed a snowball or something i don't think i've ever seen the assassin do that let me check that out not that it's a big deal but it's there okay let's see get all the way over here it would be in her inventory what does that do does it inflict the status or something? Or hmm. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be anything special. Let me take a look at the ability. Oh, it can inflict frozen. Well, I suppose that makes sense. Huh. And it's got really good accuracy, too. Huh. Yeah, better watch out for that. Okay, so. Let's see. Let's get Alyssa. Can I hit her from here? No, I cannot. So, let's see. Let's put her right there. That'll be good. Now, one thing you want to be careful for with positioning your party members is that harpies can hit a bunch of your characters on a line in front of them. And also, uh, tamers can hit two party members in a line in front of them. Or they can hit a row of three in front of them. So, got to be careful with that. And I really do need to get rid of that poison. So, let's see. You got it? No? Who has antidote? You do. Good. Okay, let's use that then. Heal her up a bit. Alright, good job. Now, as usual, I also want to defeat the monsters first, if I can. Now, here we got a retreat point. So, since I'm done with the thrower there, let's sub him out for my brute. So that way he can keep working on the sunrise there. Awesome. Oh, yeah! Now, one thing about substituting party members is that once you sub or move someone out or retreat, 
you can't get them back for the same battle, so you want to watch out for that. Okay, so let's see. Paulo, I want you to hit right there. Yeah, that'll work. So let's move back out of the way and try to freeze them again. Do that. And then I'll have Alyssa start working on the Harpy there. Um, you know, let's just keep you where you are. Yeah. Get a burn status on you if you can. Yeah, those two assassins and Rodriguez, they'll just kind of stand pat until, uh, until we kill more of these guys down here. Hey, hey all right. Okay, let's see. Joseph, go after that uh, harpy there. And I could go for a boost. And hmm, that would inflict charm. You know, let's do that. I was going to say no, because charm would overwrite the burn status. But if I did get charm on him, he would start attacking his own party members. But uh, now nah, we'll just keep going like this. Ow, quit it. So let's see, how are you doing there? Almost dead, but not quite. Okay, Alyssa. Hmm. I could attack the Harpy, but he'd probably be dead by the time I get there. Hmm. Eh, let's go for it anyway. I can get the spell to resolve the four. Yeah, if they get the chance. Come on, Alyssa. Yes! Okay, good. I could have just stand, stood around and done nothing, let the burn status kill him off, but I need, really need to work on my weapon mastery for Alyssa there. Ha ha. Nothing that they can drop for us, so. Okay, let's see. Now here. Oh, yeah, in the middle here? At least I think. Yeah, there's pitfalls there. Not that we can really take advantage of that, but it is there. Okay, Julio, you're fine. Alyssa, ooh, wow, we are taking quite a bit of damage here. Does Alyssa have return? No. Nah. Okay, well then let's just go with that. Sure. Now, you know what? Let's get you out of the way a bit more. Hmm. Yeah, let's go like this. Put you there. And the Harpy's not going to get his turn for a while anyway. So, we'll just go like that. No, it's like that. That'll work. Eventually, I'll probably want uh, Paulo to inflict no counter on Griselda, but right now I want to kill the other units first. So let them take their turns and scramble. Let's see, can I get Alyssa in range of the uh, heal? No, I cannot. Not even close. Okay. Um. Yeah, you're kind of stuck there right now. That really sucks. Well, let's see. Can I, uh, I could attack her and try to get Charm with a beat from, uh, Alyssa there. See if we can do that. Hey, all right. Now you're working for me. Nice. Well, at least Paulo's going to be okay. At least for a little while, anyway. Okay, Alyssa. Man, I really need, to, uh... Griselda to get out of the way. I can't even do anything from here, so let's just uh, take a minor fall damage. How high is that? 3.5. But she has a jump of 2. Why would she take fall damage from that? That's within her height tolerance. Hmm, that's bizarre. Hmm. Well, anyway. Okay, let's see. I can go after the Harpy, so yeah, let's go with that. Do that. Get a little beat action going. Try to remember not to attack Alyssa and H.C. Bailey. Yeah, we could also get no counter with uh, with the beat from just er, Paulo there. So basically, for this battle, I really want Alyssa and Joseph to do most of the heavy lifting. Ah, oh, nuts. That's actually kind of bad for me. 
But yeah, they got the weapon mastery to work on. Now the sticky status reduces my jump and movement stat to one. So yeah, it's gonna be pretty annoying. Let's see, maybe I can get uh, Apollo in range. Let's see, you still got your turn coming up, but not for a little while. So let's see, I'm just trying to think of the best way I can do this. What's your HP looking like? Hmm. Yeah, I don't want to accidentally heal you. Hmm. Okay, yeah, we'll just do it this way then. Hey, hey, alright. Burn, baby, burn! But now they're all gonna kinda gang up on us. Fortunately, they can't really do beats much right now. Okay, let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna have to uh, heal one of the tamers there. I, I can't wait any longer now. Oh well, at least Alyssa's still alive, anyway. Okay, let's see. Well, you've almost got your turn coming up. Okay, let's see. If I go... I could go after Tamer or the monster. I think I want to go after the monster first. Not bad, not bad. We almost got him. Uh-oh. That could put poison, which actually is kind of good, actually. Because that overwrites the sticky status, which is kind of annoying. I could have equipped tough boots to deal with the uh, sticky status, but not on Alyssa. Well, thanks for your uh, assistance there, Griselda. I do still need to get Alyssa out of there. And let's see, you do have an antidote, but I would kind of like you to hit these two with the burn status. So, let's see. Do you have antidotes? Good. Well, actually, no, I don't want you to do that. I want uh, Julia to do that. So, yeah, you can do a little bit of range with uh, antidote there. So, that works fine. Okay, let's go there. Yeah, let's go like that. Hey, all right, go Joseph. Not bad, not bad at all. Oh, great, I got burn status on the one who's dead anyway. Oh well. Okay, let's see, what do you got? Yeah, let's go down there and get a good beat on her. Maybe uh, inflict the charm status, too. Hey, hey all right. Kick ass. Uh, let's see. Now, we do have that tamer on the right there, and I probably want to kill her soon. So, if I can scramble to kill her, even with Julio, I would do it. And, yeah, it uses a lot of tactics points. That, that's better than having her heal herself. Okay, so let's see. Yeah, let's go there. And just finish her off before she can use a potion or something. Sorry, I couldn't get anyone else in there, but oh well. Well, actually, I probably could have gotten Joseph in there, but not from behind. And I wanted a guarantee. Uh, no, no, I think we're good for now. Uh-oh. Charm status wore off Griselda there. Yeah, we probably want to kill Griselda, like, now. Okay. Now, the thing with uh, Rodriguez is that with the Berserker, he has Hand Crush. And I'd really rather he not be able to uh, break my, the Chrono, for sure. The Overdrive, I would really rather not have to worry about that. So, let's see. She's going to get her turn. And then, let's see. Griselda, I need to get you out of the way. So, let's see, Alyssa and Joseph. Can I get past my... Yeah, there we go. Oh, no, I can't... Nuts. 
Well, I'll move as far away as I can. Yeah, that's about all I can do. And get the burn status on Griselda. Can you get poison on him? No. No. Oh well. Hey, hey! Alright! She's got quite a bit of HP, too. So that'll really help us out a lot. Okay, so... What I want to do now... Get you... No, 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 not yet. Put you there. And then put my brute there. So that way, Rodriguez can't get to Alyssa. Or... Paula. That's also why I didn't equip any hand armor on Julio and uh, Joseph there. Uh oh. Yeah, we need to get some healing for you there, Alyssa. If I can ever get a turn. Yeah, Berserk is actually a pretty good axe. I'm not going to use it, but it is pretty strong for what it does. Uh-oh. Ha-ha. Okay, let's see. You're almost dead anyway. So, let's see. I don't need healing for Paulo there. Okay, so let's put you just out of range of Rodriguez there. I mean, he could still hit you with a Brave Swing, but he wouldn't be able to break the hand armor. And, let's see. Oh. Hmm. Well, you're not going to get your turns for a while, anyway. So, let's do... Um, wait, where are you targeting with that? Hmm. Okay, so let's go there. And then hit Griselda there. It would have been nice if I could have hit both Griselda and Rodriguez with that. But then I would be out of range of the healing that I desperately need here. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, one thing about the uh, Tamers, one of them has a stone head, uh, piece of head gear on them. And that's the only other one you can get in the game. So if you want to get it, you better do it now if you didn't get it earlier. Otherwise, oh well. It's a really light piece of head gear. I love it myself. Okay, so let's see. I can't get Alyssa out of the way yet. So let's go after the Tamer, I think. Yeah. You don't have a... Oh, wait. She's got Charm. Okay. Um, hmm. Okay, so how about you guys go this way? Get a little beat action going there. Mostly because I don't have anything better to do at this point. Nuts. Oh, well. At least I still got a little weapon mastery there, anyway. Yeah, let's go after the assassins next. And if I can, try to keep Paulo and Alyssa out of the way. Uh, let's see. Okay, you know, what I could do is move you over here. But I couldn't get in range of her. And, yeah, he'd be, she, yeah, he'd be able to hit her if I moved Alyssa here. So, let's see. I don't want these guys to gang up on her, so I'm going to have to move out of range. Actually, how far can you move? Okay, he can move... Yeah, I'm going to have to go, like, right here. I really wish I could get Alyssa some more work, but sadly, I cannot. Ha ha! <laughs> oh, wow. I haven't seen the charm status work that well for me, like, ever. Can I do a beat with her? Probably not. No. Okay. <laughs> that would have been hilarious if we could do that. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's go there. And do another beat if we can while we're grabbing an item back. I really should start working on the other units, but they keep on backing away from me. It's like, what can I do? Nothing. Uh, no, I think we're good. Ha uh ha. -huh. Yeah, you got the assassins can't even move now, practically. Okay, let's see. You got your turn coming up, but you can't move much out of the way, can you? 
How far can you move, Rodriguez? Okay. So if I move Paulo here and try to do a cold run, I believe the, the assassin in the middle there can't get out of the way. Hopefully. Well, I don't have any hand armor for you to break, but thanks anyway. I guess you wanted to get a beat going or something. Okay, let's see. Alyssa! Let's see if I can't get you uh, through to the other side and then block where he goes off that way. Man, I can't freeze one of them. Nuts. Okay, let's put you right there. Don't even do anything. Just sit there. Block him off. And... Okay, let's go with that. And then I'll get Paulo to go on the right side there, too. Hey, hey, all right. Yeah, I'm probably going to have Paulo kind of take a back seat for a little while. Let's see, do we need any healing? No. Mm, you can use a little bit. I don't really care about that assassin that much. Okay, how about we do it like this? Uh, yeah, that'll work. Go Aerial Cure. Keep Julio up there. Don't really need Julio to do too much, but he is there. Yeah, go Alyssa! Man, that burns to his. Oh, it's so good. Paladin could have gotten it a lot earlier, but, well, I didn't. Ooh, I can hit three of them. Sweet. With, uh, Alyssa there. Oh, Alyssa could use a little healing, too. She is a little fragile right now, since she doesn't have the, the cap space yet. But once we level her up, we'll be good. Okay, how are we doing on, uh, your weapon master? If I can ever get to my menu, thank you. 726. I would like to try and finish off the sunrise this battle, if I can. I gotta get up to, like, 34 or something. Try this size. Or I could just get burn status on that one. That works too. I think I killed two of them, didn't I? Ha ha. Ha ha. Okay, I'm gonna need Joseph to stay right on uh, Rodriguez there, so. Uh, let's see. Where's the tamer's turn? Oh, that's not a tamer, that's a. Uh, assassin there. Hmm. See, Alyssa. Hmm. I'm trying to see if I can get the item bags before them, but I don't think I can. So we're just going to keep uh, blocking you off there, Rodriguez, if you don't mind. Thank you. Ha ha! Getting there. Uh oh. That could be bad. That uh, reduces. Tactics points by three. Yeah, it's a pretty annoying ability to deal with. You could equip a Sylphie Garb, which uh, reduces uh, arrow type damage or wind damage, but I don't think it's worthwhile. The damage is not that big of a problem. Okay, let's see. Alyssa, no, I can't get you out of the way. Hmm. You don't. Oh, you do have your turn coming up soon. Okay, let's move you out of the way. Don't even do anything, just move. And, let's see. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, that'll work. Not that I need it, because he's going to burn to death anyway. But I just want the uh, weapon mastery. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay, how far can you move? Hmm. So, let's see. If I move him over here, I think I can block him off completely. And, yeah, he's got a high guard rate, but that's okay. I want to block him off from hitting the rate. Alright, that works, too. Nice. And, no, I think we're good. 
It's amazing how, how many times I incidentally walk into that retreat point. Let's see. Yeah, he can't move too far up here because he'd have to jump all the way up here to get there. So, yeah, Lissa should be fine. Let's go. You know, let's grab the base point there. And Alyssa, why don't you grab the base point too? And the item bag while we're at it. Wow, we got a lot of item bags to get. That works. Yeah, too bad I can't go after that assassin too well. Oh well. Um, let's see. I'd like to hit him from behind, but then he'd hit Alyssa. So, let's see. How about we just grab another item bag? Wait for Rodriguez to get his turn, and then we'll be in good shape. Nice! Ooh, Thief Shoes. Not that I'm going to use them, but they are fairly decent. Okay, let's see. Why don't you... Hmm. Can I get Alyssa in there? Yes, I can. Okay, basically what I want to do is get Burn on Rodriguez. He has a lot of HP and, well, Burn deals damage based on your max HP. Mm. Oh well. Okay, so then I want to get Joseph up here. No boost. Oh well. Deal a bit of damage there. Maybe have Alyssa uh, try again to get burn. Try it from uh, another angle there. And if I can't do it there, then I'm just going to have uh, Julio block him off. Hey, all right. Good job. Okay, Julio. Yeah, why don't you just stand there? Just block him off. And let's see. Joseph, can we kill him? I think we can. Let's see. Yeah, let's do it. Finish him. Yeah! Woohoo! Ha uh ha. -huh. Loser! I like how he's still just kind of sitting there burning to death. But, all right, got him. But are we going to let Rodriguez go? Or should we just finish him off instead? Find out next time on Let's Play Gunger! This is HG Baby, signing off. Have a good day!